actually going straight on the Game & Watch this time by the looks of things. Yeah. No messing around. No with messing. With the, the ledger. Didn't see much success on that earlier, so I can agree. Yeah, no. <laughs> he's not. I don't think he's going to play Karen today. Are we, are we having a break? Uh, have many are we having a break after? Okay. And we're right, we so in this game. We're going straight to final destination. Sheik being uh, very aggressive. Yeah. Uh, I know that Sheik approached quite well with um, platforms, but mostly because uh, most of the stages platforms line up exactly for her, the sweet spot of her up smash, but. Uh, I mean, it's chic. She bodes just as well without. She doesn't really have any bad uh, bad stages. That is true. I thought it'd be quite nice to uh, to bring to have chic on Final Destination just because of needle camping. Yeah. It helps with the uh, patient gameplay you were talking about earlier. Mm. However, something I just noticed. I didn't know Game and Watch could duck under the needles. Could what? Game and Watch can duck under the needles. Yeah. <laughs> Ultimate counter confirmed. Ultimate right counter. Here. <laughs> True top tier. Yeah. <laughs> Seeing um, roughly equal pressure from each each characters right here. Just um, ZK's trying to call him out with the up smash, and uh, if you had a look at the frame stator of the up smash, it's actually very very good. It's quite quite unpunishable. Oh, but there there's the, the fable down throw into up air and gets the first start just like that. Don't mess with the dudes. Game of Watch is all about them dudes. Yeah. Somehow ZK's just sort of spacing his moves as Game of Watch, and uh, uh, thus is not being able to get punished quite that well. Ricky's just uh, looking for a way in right now, but he's finding it really hard. Can't even needle spam because, as you said, um, Game of Watch can just duck straight under. That being said, he is trying out the needle spam. He's having he to test uh, ZK's reaction. He guts the up air, but not quite enough to, uh, to take the stock just yet. Oh. <laughs> ZK's actually throwing the bomb straight up into the air there. This is like, no, I don't want this. This is very, very, very slow-paced game right now. Ricky is—he's uh, not really willing to go in unless he knows that he's safe because he's so far behind. Z Cakes is just—he's just a very patient player in general. I guess if you're playing somebody like Game and Watch, you kind of have to be. He like said he's, he's building up quite a lead here. Just give it about 20, 20 or so more percent, and Sheik's uh, up tilt will start killing. A uh, forward tilt, sorry. Oh, ah, oh, Ricky takes the stock with a footstool. Oh, that's what that's one way to end it. <laughs> now Rick's at ninety-three percent in quite a dangerous spot here. Yeah. Sheik with Rage is not something you get to see very often. Can she still combo with Rage? I'm not too mm, sure. Not as well. Not as well. Like uh, the the forward air strings are quite a lot more difficult to get off. Uh, when you when you're high percent, it's probably generally better to do back air strings instead. And. Uh, ZK's just slightly missing out on the uh, down throw up tilt combo. It was a nice air dodge by Rick. Huh? Mm. Ricky 
just finding it very difficult to, um, yeah, like I said, it's got a lot of rage, so it can't really get a lot of cut off percent. Me? Me? Oh, the down smash kills from ZK. He has nearly a full stock lead here. Only about 150% to take <laughs> it. <laughs> a kill's a kill. Yeah, now Z Cakes with a quite confident lead. He's just playing very, very, playing very patient. He knows that he doesn't really have to go. Was that a torn? Um, no. Oh yeah, the bells are torn. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Z Cakes is getting a bit overconfident, <laughs> only slightly. Uh, yep. Five five minutes into game one though. We're still. Uh, it's a very long game. Yeah. Is so this is uh, this is what happens when two people want to play patiently. And it's also generally the pace of Smash 4 in general. Yeah. The wind box makes me laugh every time. Mm, no. it's ju just too low percent in order to get the uh, down throw into up, up smash combo. Oh. ZK's calling out the spot dodge there with the uh, with the jab. Oh, not killing yet. Oh. Z-Cake's not at 100 just over 100%. <laughs> and so people, people say Sheik's Up B is not that reliable of a, um, of a kill move, you just saw right there. I didn't know that that fell. Oh! oh an oil, oil panic! The bucket. So Z-Cake's taking game number one. Well, with what looks to be quite a long stock, but in the end... That is really interesting mechanic. I did not know that Game of Watch's downbeat was filled by Sheik's up air. Yeah, for some, uh, I guess I guess Sheik's up B has a projectile for some reason. It seems to be really powerful as well because the old panic did a lot of damage. The, uh, the vanish explosion, yeah. As we see, we saw before, it's quite pow like relatively powerful. is interesting. So we have a game now. We have Z Cakes one up against Rick. Yeah. Should see a lot less uh, should hopefully see a lot less camping now though uh, with the aid of platforms. Sheik on town and city would probably favour her. Yeah. Sheik Sheik does uh, does enjoy killing off at the top so town and city is quite a good uh, good uh, stage for him. I think Rick has had a <coughs> decent amount of trouble trying to land against the game watch here. Yeah. Oh. I think Ricky realised that the uh, the down air has a second hitbox. Just, uh, just getting hit by that a little bit, but he already seems to be a bit more confident in this game so far. He's uh, applying a lot more pressure than last time. She's playing a lot more aggressive, yes. Mm. And uh, Z Cake's trying to go for the tech chase there, but doesn't actually get anything as a result. It's currently 40% uh, behind, but if if uh, if Z Cake's can read the DI well, he can probably make that a backup quite quite easily. Oh, it's getting more sacks than Zoe Panic there. Oh, he misses the punish. Doesn't get any punish for that uh, free fall there. Oh, and the armor on the up smash takes it at 70% on cheek. Jeez. Oh, he misses the nine. He got it, but oh. nowhere near. The ga game was giving him a... <laughs> game was just like, you know, I, I, I want to see you win, <laughs> but actually, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I think a lot of Ricky's combos don't really work against Game & Watch as well, because being such a light character. Oh! Ooh, nice. And he reads the, reads the regular get up and uh, bouncing fishes get the stock. <coughs> Ooh. ZK's trying his luck to see if he could get another nine. Only gets a five instead. Racks up a bit of damage but doesn't get the kill. You can see, see he's, look, he's looking for a grab right now. He's looking really hard for a grab. He knows that he can kill if he gets one. Yeah. <laughs>
unfortunately, there's a uh, technical problem with the second mic, and uh, yeah, it's basically just not working. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry about that. Anyway, see, uh, see, Cakes is now an entire stuck ahead almost. Oh, he tries out his luck again with the side B, only gets a 7. Uh, Ricky also just keeping up the pressure again. He does have to play a bit more defensively now because he is uh, quite far behind. And ZK with the reverse uh, back air there, actually catching him out. Misses the shield grab. Oh, oh wow, that actually dies to the upper. And like I said, you can just see how, how light game launch is there. How light game launch is and how uh, low the ceiling on Town City is as well. One of the reasons. So, yeah. it, take this it seems game. to be a slightly faster game than last time. By that like two <laughs> minutes. You get the do, that got the do, and that's gonna be game. That is game. That is 2-0 to Z Cakes. Taking it pretty confidently on the first game. Got a bit shakier on the second game, but still almost stuck ahead. It was nice adaptation by Rick to realize.